the reform that we have for the Bank of Canada is to be sure to, uh, every five years, the, the federal government can sign an agreement with the Bank of Canada about the monetary policy. And what we will do, instead of having an inflation target of 2%, because as you know, inflation is a hidden tax. Uh, why inflation of 2% is good? Why not inflation of 10%? If 2% is good, 10% inflation must be better. No, inflation, it is a tax, and we need to be sure that the Bank of Canada will have a new target for the inflation. And as you know, the Bank of Canada, it's an independent entity from the government, but every five years, we can give some direction to the Bank of Canada, and our direction will be to have a policy for, uh, in for uh, inflation at 0%. If you have 0% inflation, you'll keep your purchasing power, and that's important. You know, right now, when you have inflation with... Uh, one dollar in your pocket, you cannot buy the same amount of goods when there's inflation, but you'll keep your purchasing power. That's a huge reform, and we are the only political body to speak about that. And that, with the reform to balance the budget, that will help us to be uh, more prosperous, and that will help also Canadians to have more of their money in their pockets. That's an important reform.